back guys. Max was saying back, no better. Mm. Whoa! It fell. It will flip it back. Flip it back. This is what I found on the beach. I think it's a shrimp or a sand hopper. I'm not sure. It looks more like a shrimp to me. But anyway, I think it's, it doesn't look dead. But it does look dead at the same time. Yeah. So this is Rabness Beach. Our boat is out there, the little yellow one. It's very nice around here. It's, it's exceptionally nice beach. I'm in a bit of a shade. As you saw in the last place, there was a little like shrimp sand up the top thing. Yeah, there's big rocks like that. But apart from that, it's nice around here. There's my dad's mates, and then my dad's mates, other one that you saw in the recent post. Dad, he's bait digging at this moment in time. Just, we're just, I'm just chilling to be honest with you guys. There he is, he's bait digging right there, because we want to do a bit of fishing on the boat, and he's got all the tools out here. And all, um, apart from that, it's nice round here. What? What have you caught? Some limpets, some rag, and some lug. Let's have a look. <sighs> Where? That's it. Very sandy, but some rocks, a bit of mud. That's about it. It's a falling down. It's very nice. It's just a bit of nature, isn't it? I'll show you that wreck in a minute. I'm just gonna go over to show you the long cliffs. Danger. Um, yeah, that's about it. All the way up there, the cliffs. But there's a right cliff over here. I'll be showing you. Ipswich. It might not be Ipswich, it is Ipswich, yeah, it is. Manning Tree, Rabness, the River Stir. Harwich is down. Back over there. Manning Tree. It's over there. Stutton is over the other side. But apart from that, that's about it around here. Now I'm going to go over to show you the cliffs. These are the cliffs and the shark tooth in there. I found shark tooths in the past. I'd say they're about 100 ton feet high. Yeah, they're very nice. There's rocks, so I'd watch out on windy days and some wet days. Because that could like come down and you. But I've climbed up there before. And believe it or not, over here, at, when the tide's filling in, you can't get round it. So you have to, um, you will go up to your knees about deep, unless it's a spring that's impossible, or you have to swim by. And you won't be able to get to this beach, any of it, because it will be cut off because of the tides. It's very, there's loads of people around here, loads. Been the 16th, by the way. I'm just gonna say I'm now proceeding to walk up to the the wreck, so I'll catch you when I'm there. You can still see the rib bottom part of the boat. Um, this is where my dad gets limpets. I'm very slip around here, I nearly slipped. <laughs> um, it's around 28 degrees today. Anyway, um, I'm gonna be careful here because I'm very slippery clay, slippery mud. I feel like I'm going to slip any second. <laughs> I'm back on normal. But this is 
it. It has a pointer to tell you that it's here. It's got ribs, look there, the ribs over there. Um, I know it's got to be at least 200, 100 years old in it, I don't know. Thank you for watching today's video, subscribe and like, bye!